Thanks for checking out this episode of Pit Stop. Today, we're gonna to talk about website personalization, what it is and why it matters to you, the Canadian car dealer. So first off, what is personalization? It's dynamically and in real time, personalizing the website to the individual visitor based on the user data that we have about them. Or said in a different way, showing a relevant message to an individual instead of showing the same message to everybody. So let's run you through a quick example of what website personalization could look like. Now imagine I come to this dealer's website and they have this image and this offer on their homepage. Now a lot of people might not get out of bed in the morning saying, hey, I want a minivan, right? This is, this is what I want. This offer, this message might not appeal to anyone, might not appeal to everyone. So I'm on this website and I start going through it and I start looking at inventory. And now I'm looking at specific inventory. I've decided, you know, I want to, uh, a car for an active lifestyle, we like to go camping, I'm looking at Forerunners, right? So I'm looking at Forerunner SRPs and I'm looking at Forerunner VDPs, vehicle description pages. And then for whatever reason, I have to leave the website, right? Don't think of leaving the website, it's not always a negative thing, right? Maybe I'm at the office and my boss comes around the corner, so I gotta, you know, I gotta leave your site or I'm at my house and my kid's pulling on my pant leg, so I gotta leave your site. But I come back, right? We know a lot of your traffic is returning visitors. Now that we have all this information about this individual user, we can show them a personalized and relevant message. So now it's a beautiful image of a forerunner with a message that says, hey, welcome back. This month we have great offers on forerunners. Do you want a new one or do you want a used one? We are creating a custom conversion funnel for this user based on the information we have about them, making the website much, much more relevant. You have to remember also the different incentives that the manufacturer might put out or different promotions that you're using. These individuals might not be aware of them. I'm sure you have promotions and incentives on your website somewhere, but they might not be going to those parts of your website. Now, personalization might not necessarily be new. You've probably seen it before on sites like amazon.ca or maybe you've seen it on services like Netflix, right? This is where the recommended for you comes up or products that you might also like. The great thing about personalization is it is new to the Canadian automotive space and very few dealers are taking advantage of it. So does it work? Why do you need to seriously consider this? The data backs it up. What we're seeing with Canadian dealers who undertake personalization is increased user engagement on their website as well as an increase in website leads. Be an early adopter, get to the party before everybody else and start taking advantage of website personalization. If you got additional questions, feel free to comment or share below and we'll help you out.